So rockfall. Rockfall should be on the mind of every single climber, especially right now. We have had two major rockfalls in Yosemite, killing one climber and injuring another person in the past, uh, I would say, 48 hours from when I'm videotaping this. It's uh, the 29th of September, 2017. And a lot of times there's not a whole lot that you can do with rock fall. Um, the climber that was killed in Yosemite recently was actually not on the wall. They were, uh, from the reports that I've received, it was on the approach to a climb when the rock fall came down and took the life of one climber and injured another. Our prayers go out to Andy Foster and especially his family. Um, there are some things that you can do though to protect yourself while climbing against rock fall and that is be very deliberate with your movements. Test your holds, tap on them. Uh, when I'm climbing I always grab things gently and fill, fill it. Hey, the rock will speak to you in a way. It will let you know whether it is loose or not. If it sounds hollow or if you, you have that feeling that it may be uh, loose or it could come out, tap on it. Now, when it's a huge piece, like just fell that was uh, the size of uh, an apartment building, that might not give you any signs at all. It's understanding why that stuff falls can help us though. Uh, typically, it's uh, in a freeze thaw cycle. Um, but just gravity. You know, gravity's constantly pulling on us, it's constantly pulling on the rocks too. So when you're out there, be careful, be safe. I hope to see you.